Hi friends, welcome to my channel Excellent Ideas in Education. Today we are going to learn about polynomial problem. This is very important problem. If alpha and beta are the zeros of the polynomial x square plus x minus 2 then find the value of 1 by alpha minus 1 by beta. You see in this question minus 2 is given. Instead of minus 2 k is given means what you will do? You will take sum of the zeros and product of the zeros formula and solve the problem. In this question, we will use two methods. First method is splitting the middle term. Second method is sum of the zeros formula and product of the zeros formula we will use. First, we will see the splitting the middle term method. First method, x square plus x minus 2. Here x square means here 1 is there. So, 1 minus 2 is minus 2. So, 1, 2 is 2. 2 comes. Plus is there. So, greater number you put plus here. Here is minus. Minus 1 into plus 2 is minus 2. Minus 1 plus 2 is equal to plus 1. You see plus 1 also comes. Minus 2 also comes. So, how we will split this one 1x one square you have to write this 2 minus 1x plus 2x minus 2 so you take this 2 to pair x is common you can take it as x is outside so x minus 1 here also comes x minus 1 so you see 2 so 2 can take 2 outside so put plus plus into plus 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 into minus minus so x minus 1, x minus 1 is common. So, you can take it as x minus 1 is common outside. So, plus 2. So, x plus 2. So, how you will write? x plus 2 is equal to 0. x is equal to minus 2. x is minus 1 is equal to 0. x is equal to 1. Here, you can take alpha is equal to minus 2. Beta is equal to 1. Here, alpha is equal to 1 beta is equal to minus 2. First you can take alpha minus 2. After that you can take alpha. This one you can take alpha 1 beta minus 2. So in this question what is given 1 by alpha minus 1 by beta. You have to substitute here alpha and beta in that equation. 1 by alpha minus 1 by beta. 1 by alpha is minus 2. Beta is 1. So 1 by 1. You can take 2 is common. So, minus goes up. Minus 1. Here is into 2 into 2. So, minus 2. So, minus 3 by 2 here. Here, 1 by 1. Alpha is 1. Beta is 2. Minus 1 by minus 2. So, minus minus plus 1 by 1 plus 1 by 2. So, 2 you can take it common. So, into 2 into 2. So, 2 plus 1. So, 3 by 2. So, here is plus 3 by 2. 1 by alpha minus 1 by beta is equal to plus or minus 3 by 2. This is the answer. This is the first method. Second method, we will use sum of the zeros and product of the zeros formula. Sum of the zeros. Alpha plus beta is equal to minus b by a. So, what is A here? A is equal to 1. B is equal to 1. C is equal to minus 2 in this equation. So, minus B by A. Minus is minus. B is 1. A is 1. So, alpha plus beta is equal to minus 1. This is the first equation. Product of the zeros. Alpha beta is equal to C by A. C by A, C is equal to minus 2, A is equal to 1. So, alpha beta is equal to minus 2. This is second equation. So, what is given? 1 by alpha minus 1 by beta. So, you can cross this equal to beta minus alpha by alpha beta. So, beta minus alpha by alpha beta. So, how we will write beta minus alpha beta minus alpha the whole square is equal to beta square plus alpha square minus 2 beta alpha. So, beta minus alpha. 
only we need so this one we need to remove so beta minus alpha is equal to this one root comes here so beta square plus alpha square minus 2 beta alpha root this one how we will write alpha square plus beta square minus 2 alpha beta root beta minus alpha but you see here 2 alpha beta alpha beta value we know alpha square plus beta square value we don't know alpha plus beta value only we know so what we will do in this case uh, alpha plus beta the whole square is equal to alpha square plus beta square plus 2 alpha beta this is the formula right so we need alpha square plus beta square value so how we will take uh, alpha square plus beta square keep it here alpha plus beta the whole square minus 2 alpha beta this plus goes here is minus so alpha plus beta square value we got it so now beta minus alpha is equal to alpha plus beta the whole square minus 2 alpha beta minus 2 alpha beta root here is divided by alpha beta so put divided by alpha beta so here how we will write minus 2 alpha beta minus 2 alpha beta is minus 4 alpha beta alpha plus beta the whole square minus 4 alpha beta root divided by alpha beta so alpha plus beta is minus 1 so put minus 1 the whole square minus 4 alpha beta 4 alpha beta is 4 into alpha beta is minus 2 root so what comes this one 1 4 2 are 8 minus minus plus plus 8 root is equal to root 9 equal to plus or minus 3 below is what comes alpha beta is minus 2 so divided by minus 2 so plus 3 by minus 2 or minus 3 by minus 2 so this one what comes cancel it what is the final answer 1 by alpha minus 1 by beta is equal to minus 3 by 2 comma plus 3 by 2 or plus or minus 3 by 2 this is the answer you see here this and this is same answer but different methods which one is easiest for you you can follow this thanks for watching this video